टुडे वी विल डिस्कस सम मोर न्यूमेरिकल्स ऑफ नॉर्मेलिटी फिफ्टीन एम एल ऑफ एन ओ एच सोल्यूशन आर न्यूट्रिलाइज बाई ट्वेल्व एम एल पॉइंट टू फाइव एन एच टू एस ओ फोर कैलकुलेट द नॉर्मेलिटी ऑफ एन ओ एच सॉल्यूशन इन दिस क्वेश्चन एन वन वी वन इक्वल टू एन टू वी टू एन वन वी वन फॉर एन ओ एच एंड एन टू वी टू फॉर एच टू एस ओ फोर एन वन वी वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट एन वन बिकॉज एन वन इज द नॉर्मेलिटी ऑफ एन ओ एच वी वन इज गिवेन फिफ्टीन एम एल एन टू इज गिवेन पॉइंट टू फाइव वी टू इज गिवेन ट्वेल्व एम एल Now, putting these values in the normality equation, n one v one equal to n two v two. N one is the normality of n o h into fifteen. N two is the normality of h two s o four. That is point two five. Volume is twelve m l. N one equal to point two five into twelve divided by fifteen. By solving these. we get n1 equal to 1 upon 5 it means normality of nuh is 1 upon 5 this is our answer now next question is calculate the strength of एच टू एस ओ फोर सोल्यूशन इन ग्रेम्स पर लीटर उस ट्वेल्व एम एल नीट फिफ्टीन एम एल एन बाई टेन एन यू एच फॉर न्यूट्रलाइजेशन formula used in this numerical is normality equation that is n1 v1 equal to n2 v2 n1 v1 first of all we get we calculate the normality of h2so4 by the formula n1 v1 equal to n2 v2 then we calculate strength of h2so4 in grams per liter by the formula s equal to ne तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी कैलकुलेट एन वन एन वन इज द नॉर्मेलिटी ऑफ एच टू एस ओ फोर वी वन इज द वॉल्यूम ऑफ एच टू एस ओ फोर एन टू इज द नॉर्मेलिटी ऑफ एन यू एच एन वी टू इज द वॉल्यूम ऑफ एन यू एच वी वन इज 12 ml n2 is 1 upon 10 uh, v2 is 15 ml now putting these values in the formula we get n1 into 12 equal to 1 upon 10 into 15 by solving we get n1 equal to 1 upon 8 it means n of h2so4 is 1 upon 8 but in this question 
we want to solve S. S is the concentration in grams per liter. Suppose S is the concentration of H2SO4 in grams per liter and N is the normality of H2SO4 that is 1 by 8. E of H2SO4 is calculated by the formula molecular weight divided by basicity of acid or number of replaceable hydrogen atom. Molecular weight of H2SO4 is 1 into 2 plus 32 plus 16 into 4 divided by 2 because basicity of H2SO4 is 2. Molecular weight of H2SO4 is 98 divided by 2 that is equal to 49. Now putting these values in the formula S equal to any S is sorry N is 1 upon 8 and E is 49. So value of S becomes 16.125 grams per liter. Next question is what volume of 3% sodium carbonate will be required to neutralize one liter n by 10 H2SO4. For sodium carbonate, three percent means three grams of sodium carbonate is present in hundred ml of solution. 100 ml means 0.1 liter. When 100 is divided by 1000, then we get 0.1 liter. In this question, first of all, we calculate normality of sodium carbonate. Normality of sodium carbonate is calculated by the formula N equal to W upon EV. E of sodium carbonate is molecular weight of sodium carbonate divided by number of positive or negative valencies. Molecular weight of sodium carbonate is 106 and number of positive valencies or negative valencies is 2. Then 106 is divided by 2 and we get 53 that is equivalent weight of sodium carbonate. Now for calculating volume of sodium carbonate, normality equation is N1V1 equal to N2V2. N1V1 is for sodium carbonate and N2V2 is for H2SO4. Before calculating volume of sodium carbonate, normality of sodium carbonate is calculated N equal to W upon EV. W is 3 grams, equivalent weight is 53 and volume is 0.1. It means normality is 30 upon 53. 
n means normality of sodium carbonate that is equivalent to n1 so n1 is 10 upon 53 volume in this question volume is calculated by this formula n2 is 1 upon 10 normality of H2SO4 is given in the question and volume is 1 liter in this formula unit of volume will be same so V1 and V2 both are taken in ml so 1 liter equal to 1000 ml so V2 equal to 1 liter equal to 1000 ml V1 equal to 1000 into 53 upon 10 into 30. Then volume by solving these values we get 176.67 ml. So 176.67 ml of 3% sodium carbonate will be required to neutralize 1 liter N by 10 H2SO4. So, this is our answer. If you want a video tutorial on any specific topic of chemistry, please comment below. If you like this video, then like, share, comment and subscribe this video. For more articles on chemistry, please visit our site chemistryonline.guru. Thank you.